Good everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix the error writing a temporary file whenever you're trying to install any applications on your computer. Now, you might come across this error message uh, whenever you're trying to install any application. Now, there are a couple of steps which you could try to get this issue resolved. Now, the first step, what I would suggest you to do is I would suggest you to go ahead and restart your computer. Once you restart your computer, you will have to go to the location of the file which you're trying to install. In my case, I have the file saved on the desktop for the demonstration purpose all you need to do is you will have to do a right click on office setup.exe it could be different in your case since i'm trying to install office setup.exe i will go to this location do a right click and choose the option which says run as administrator once uh, i click on run as administrator you might come across a user access control prompt asking you to yes or continue so you may go ahead and click on yes or continue and that should go ahead with the installation now in case if your issue has been resolved well and good in case if you are still not able to install the application the next step what i would suggest you to do is i would suggest you to go and verify the temporary folder path on your computer to do this what you will have to do is you can copy the path from my video description do a right click on the start button and then click on run paste the path in the run window and then click on ok so in case if it opens which means that you have a correct temporary folder path in case if you get an error saying that verify the or location or address not found in that case you will have to go ahead and create a new temporary folder in case if you are able to open the temporary folder what you could do is you could go ahead and delete everything what you have in the temporary folder you can do a shift delete or hit delete on your keyboard in case if you get prompt you may go ahead and click on continue with this what will happen is you are trying to empty all the temporary files which are there on the computer once this is done you may close this window and in case and then try to install the application and check if your issue has been resolved now in spite of trying this if you are still facing a problem the next step what i would suggest you to do is i would suggest you to go ahead and create a new temporary folder to do this you can go back you can press uh, you can do a right click on the start button and then click on run copy the path from the location from the video description and click on ok so you will have to copy the path user profile app data local under this location you will have to go ahead and create a temporary folder so you can do a right click and then click on new folder with this what you're trying to do is you're going to create a new temporary folder name the folder as temp hey okay. uh, once you create this folder copy this path that is c users your username app data local temp minimize this window once you have minimized this window do a right click on the start button and then click on run in the run window go ahead and type s ystm.cpl and click on ok so this will take you to the system properties once you have the system properties window you will have to go ahead and click on advanced under advanced click on environment variables under this section make sure the path for temp and tmp is being set to the default temporary location in our case we have you will have to copy the path so make sure the path has been set to temp in case if it is not been set to default what you can do is you can click on edit paste the path from the temporary location and then click on ok follow the same step for tmp path so under the user variables so select it and then click on edit paste the path and click on ok click on ok then click on apply and then click on ok restart your computer and check if you are able to install the application in case if you are able to install the application well and good you don't have to worry about the next step now the last step what i would suggest you to do is i would suggest you to make sure you have enough permission to the temporary folder on your computer to do this what you need to do is you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on run copy the path make sure you have the path as uh, c users and your username app data local i will mention this path in the video description you can paste it directly and then click on ok once you go to this location that is c users your username app data and local find the folder which says temp do a right click on temp folder this is nothing but your temporary location folder and then click Click on properties once you click on properties click on security under security make sure you have a full control for the folder in case if you don't see a full control what you can do is you can select the system and then click on edit click on add and type the object name as everyone click on check names 
click on OK and make sure you have given a full control for the temporary folder. Click on apply and then click on OK. Then click on OK again. Close this window, restart your computer and then try to install the app. This should definitely fix up. Part of trying all this step and if you're still facing a problem, I would suggest you to leave me a comment in the comment section so that I can come up with the possible solution. I hope this video was useful. In case if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a great day.